Coach Knut. Camp Knut was a massive success, and you all knew it was a massive success. It went really well. The owner of the gym there, his name is Rob. Yeah. He wants to – he called me, and he's like, yo, let's make a gym together, and let's do it, you know, you and me. So I said, sure. And – I didn't really know if it would ever come into fruition, but in the it comments. did. So, me and Rob, will, the guy uh, who owns the gym that we're going to today, we are officially making a gym. I am going to try to make it very good for Twitch chat, because I want my goal would be for you guys to be able to go there even for a day. We are going to have it so that if you Twitch Prime to the gym, that that would be <clears> your considered like payment to go there for the day. Another thing with this gym, and this is the big announcement part, Knut is going to move here, and Knut is going to be running the gym, and it is actually going to be official. So Knut is actually going to be officially running the gym. Yes. So Knut is moving here. Uh, the, he's doing his paperwork and stuff, and he is going to be moving here with, and he's going to be in charge with the gym with Rob. Because obviously I don't know how to run a gym. You know what I mean? I think this is really good. I think it's good for the community. Uh, I thought this would be a fun thing to do. Uh, Rob really, he, I mean, he's built multiple gyms. So, like, this is nothing new to him. And, uh, uh, let, yeah. Let's be real. Uh, I, I have talked a lot to Rob. He is the main boss of the gym. Just so you know. Rob is the main. I If he says this is better, he... <clears throat> He is the main boss of the gym. He he knows how to run the gym. He has successfully turned, got in, in a bad gym, turned it around, to uh, and made it a successful gym. I'm not going to. Uh, but is he an Elden Lord Knut? Not sure if I can trust him if he isn't. I will. The the thing I will be taking more care of is the personal training part where I will be the pretty face of the personal trainers. I will take that part. I will probably ma do some management as well if that's needed. We'll see. <laughs> okay, let me rephrase. I'll be the ugly face of the trainers. And do you know what? If people are coming there to train from Twitch chat and they're paying, and I am there, I'm probably willing to give some hints. Maybe sometimes. Th listen, this is all about like I, I, I didn't, I haven't thought it well through. But if they're, if they're there already, and I have time, I might start doing like some training sessions with the people that are coming in myself as well, not only directing it to other coaches. That would be pretty pog, wouldn't it? You will be water boy Knut. Zumba classes with Knut. The thing is, I have no... Do you still uh, looking to do online training with, uh, for fat streamers? Sometimes I'd, uh, yes, duck. I'm just not 100% sure how many I could pull in because it is a bit up and down how active people are, right? Uh, but, but why not? I have time to take in one more if someone... The thing is, this is the thing. I haven't read the comments. Okay, I'll read them. Wrong. Happy for the big man, but I will miss the EU streaming times. Congrats, Knut. Replay. Thank... Oh, yeah, yeah. I will probably... Have a similar schedule as I have now. Just start a bit later. I can't listen. One of the reasons why I'm streaming all night here is because I want to hit both audiences right. Both EU and NA. Th that's why I stream to 5 a.m. in the morning. When I live there... I, my goal is still to hit both audiences, EU and NA. And there's no cap. The goal is still dumbest comment ever incoming. 
He will be back uh, when he starts missing his welfare and pension. I can't wait for him to talk about American politicians. Hehe. <laughs> Why the fuck would uh, Knut miss welfare? No one in his family is on it. <laughs> I could tell you, but then I would have to kill you. Think about it until tomorrow and I'll let you live another day. When I start missing Norwegian welfare and pension. First of all, where is the pension? Where is my pension? Second of all, where is my welfare? What do I get? Where is my welfare payments? Because I can't seem to fucking find them. Wait. Oh, we have the largest wealth fund in the world. Or oil fund. Can I just sell my shares? And maybe get it, get the money onto my account? Is that... Can I do that? Yes, I'm a millionaire. Or? Wait. Our money? Yes, you can get it in the channel points. Uh, replay. Wait. I'll just sell my share of the oil fund. And retire right now. <laughs> Ruben has worries he has to move tomorrow. Was worried he has to move tomorrow. Why does he have to move tomorrow? Can it replay? No A replay. He doesn't need those things. He can just make tons of money in America and live off, off of that uh, money by way of investments and uh, how he saves his money. Can it likely will succeed in America? Thank you! Listen, I think just by moving to America that I will get. Th th this is me being honest. Moving to America isn't only because of oh, taxes in Norway. That's the meme, right? But it, but it is the opportunities. Because you said yesterday that you're selling the apartment in Stange. He can buy it, Pantan. Ruben can get it. We're not selling it tomorrow anyway. This will be this is a process. Don't forget the freedom. It isn't about the freedom, it isn't about for me as a streamer, for my family building a future when I am a streamer. The opportunities you get in America, the opportunities you get by living around others that's doing the same is so much more. And being in my position it is th there's a difference there one thing is the american dream just oh i'll i'll just sell everything i own and just try to move to america no i have all i have a lot of friends there that is doing the same we have seen the results of just being there for a month earlier i'm not saying that it will be fifty thousand viewers every day i'm just saying Collabing with others, getting to uh, to work with them, doing that more, getting yeah, the gym we're talking about, sponsorships. It's just networking. It's it it is just taking it to the next step, right? The collaborations, yeah. It makes sense. We can meme about politics and all the shit. I'll tell you one thing. I will not stop ranting about politics when I move to fucking America. There will just be different political rants about stupidity that is going on. Because believe me, there's just as much stupidity down in America. It's just different. <laughs> so you're getting the car rants. It'll be even worse. Maybe it will be even worse. But it will be different. <laughs> Biden rants, maybe. Maybe Biden rants, maybe Trump rants. Too many parking spaces. I'm, I'm, I don't think I will complain about... Um, I, I might... Uh, one thing I might foresee is that when it's fucking 45 degrees next summer, you never know if I will be ranting a little about the, the heat. But I will always think, imagine if it was minus degrees and icy roads. Jesus Christ, that would be even worse. I just have to remember 
So we're talking next summer. That is the plan. We need to get the visas and everything ready. What happens with Twisted 8 then? Just curious. So ironic, I don't even know what Twisted 8 is at this point. It was just uh, the, the Twisted 8. So ironic, start to just... I'm not sure if you... It, it just... Psh, so so I, for me, that has just been a, a, a thing that is standing below my stream. I don't even know at this point what it is anymore. It was someone that tried to start up some uh, org in Norway? I said, yes, I can join. I haven't. I haven't signed shit. So I can just remove it whenever I want. Of course, wife and daughter is coming. Did you stop drinking gamers ups? Yeah, I'm not working with them at this point, no. My daughter... She can't wait to move to America. That's at least what she's saying. Wife, girlfriend, but they're saying wife. Of it now for no reason, but I indeed vanished. Yeah, yeah, Saronix. I, I was just. My question was Saronix to you. <laughs> Is this something you're like, ha ha ha? What about uh, Twisted Eight or in? <laughs> or if it was the question, whatever happened to Twisted Eight? I couldn't. <laughs> It was. It could be both of them. <laughs> PC coming to uh, US too. Will you sending it? No, we'll be selling it. My home PC. This PC is owned by my Norwegian company. This one, the one in the back. That's my private PC that I'm using for my company as well. <laughs> but it doesn't matter, right? I will probably just tell Starforge have. Uh, a few computers uh, ready for me when I'm coming to the US. Have my computers ready. I'm not bringing this. We're letting them stay in the house. Green Media LLC incoming. I need to start that, yes. That's what I need to start. So. Normally I would Omega Lull, but then remember that you built your own PC. What is the Omega Lull for? I always find it funny that people with free healthcare in EU d don't know jobs usually provided. Because they don't know shit because they only hear what the media is saying. Don't you think the gym, my job at the gym will provide me a, probably a little bit uh, cheaper healthcare than... Uh, or just have like a thing they're giving to their employees that we can do? Like a package? That's what normal is in America, isn't it? Yeah, I might have to pay a little bit, but that's it. Hi Knut, do you maybe know when the gym today? I want to start with you. I have private healthcare through my job in the UK. I work for an American company even though we have the NHS. Simled, so this is how it will be. First, I will apply for a work visa in the US. Gym job, as you have seen, I have a job, I have the streaming, I will create a company, my own company in the US as well. Same, f uh, that is for the stream, right? That's what I'm going, that's that's the plan. Easy. Um, I'm going to help out managing the gym. I will have my, my miskiffs side of the gym. That will be my job. I will I will take care of his side of the gym he, and because uh, and then complain. Robert, which is the owner of Big Tex, for the house solo man. Thank you for the prime. For the he will take. He will be like I have talked to him a lot about this, and I agree. Like I, you know, when you're going into business with someone that you don't know that well. But you can look at his track record, right? Number one. You can see how successful his gym has been. He has sent over numbers. But you can also see, is this something you agree in? Because when he talks about how he wants a gym to be, how he has done it with big techs, all of those things, you can see, is this something we can work with? Or will it just be arguing about all the bullshit that is happening, we don't agree and shit? Then... I would probably advise Miss Gift to not do it, but he, I agree in how he runs the gym. That's how I would have done it myself if I had the knowledge he has. So I think this will be easy.